Hello, everybody, and welcome or welcome back to Ishii and the auto battling deck builder that has consumed my thoughts and my mind. We are going to be checking out Muhu again here today, but I'm not too sad about it because we're going to be checking out a different deck here for him. Obviously, there is the deck that I would consider to be overpowered, probably, in the Metal Spirit, like infinite stacking deck, and I'm sure that that's what. At least one or both of these Muhus are going to do. I'm going to try. Big, big keyword. Try. This is actually a nice start. Let's just do that. Uh, to go for the Earth Spirit deck. It's something that when I've played off camera uh, with this character, I found it's just, it gets countered pretty easily. And the final payoff card that you get for tier 5 uh, breakthrough for this character to make the deck apparently work. I find it to be situational at best. Uh, like, there's times where I feel like the deck works better without it, which is kind of... I don't know. I feel like I feel like the Tier 5 payoff card should be so good that it is always going to be a part of the ideal setup, right? That's At least that's the baseline I have. So we'll see if we can make it work, though, today. I'd like to. The card in question. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, just barely. The card in question, it like it cuts your defense in half. Your current defense gets cut in half, and it does damage equal to I think like three times the amount. What are we doing? 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 Let's go painter. Uh it's it's fairly non-committal. Water spirit's active, so I guess we could run this. It's just 8 damage. Uh, Muhu. It looks like you have a relatively solid-ish setup. The best we could probably expect to do here is... Oh, you're not even running the Penetrate on that. It says it's active, but that's just because we're viewing it. I'm sure your deck is better than it was. Okay. Tucci, you running the Force of Water as well? No. No. You're just running. You're just running the guard spirit so that you don't have that loop through. Okay. Well, the good news is because I went first, I do get to win. But that's kind of what I expected. That's why it was important for me to go first. That's why I, I, uh, you know, made an effort to make that happen. This is awkward, but because you want the force of water earlier, but it it doesn't necessarily work out that way. Uh, draw a Wood Spirit card. Cultivation up by two. Three less re-rolls. Beginning of battle, get a Chi. I don't think that Chi really matters where we're going. Where we're going, we don't need Chi. Do we? Hold on. This Grinding Ink is weird, because it costs a Chi and then gives you a Chi. So it means that I can't have it here, but I can have it here. It's It's odd. But I'm not going to keep it for long. It's just kind of here to sort of pad out my early game. I also feel like I want to trash this. There's a real chance I'm not going first if I don't trash this. I'll trash it. I'm probably not going... Like Ideally, I'm not going Water Spirit. I want to go Earth. I want to try out that. Whether or not the game is going to let me do it. And look at that! That one final trash meant that I get to go first. Will it mean that I win? I don't know. Formation spirits? So you're going formation, huh? Interesting. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Interesting. I've never seen this character go formation. There's probably something that I... Flying Brush, this is what I want. Defense 6 after playing the next card, Chase. That's why I wanted to go Painter. That's why I became a Painter. Um. Oh my word. I don't want to spend all my rerolls here. Ah, 
Uh, yeah, I don't want to spend all my rerolls here. It's important that we... I'd say it's imperative that we save them for later. We'll see what we can do, though. I don't think I've ever run Cosmos Seal. It's weird. It upgrades well for damage. So getting the tier 2 on it is pretty nice. Going from 4 damage to 8 damage? It, it upgrades well if you just have this kind of awkward early game funk. I don't know how many decks it's going to be in that, like, span into the mid game. Late game? I'm not sure. Uh, do we go first? Probably not. This character usually gets a, a lead early. Yeah, we're tied, so... We're tied, so she gets the coin flip in her favor. I would I would reckon that could be the difference maker easily at this point in time. Kind of depends where the cards fall. Oh, shoot. Wait. You do six damage? Oh, beautiful. It, on a defensive, defensive build, going first doesn't always matter quite as much. Um, so we picked a, a little thing here that makes it so whenever we absorb wood cards, we gain max health uh, up to seven times. So I'm just going to keep running this. This is a fine deck. It's not a good deck. But we don't need a good deck. We need we need a pretty good to pretty good deck. Okay, well, I don't have any way to defend against you. I can't stop this. And also you have ignore defense. You're this character. This character gets um Oh no, you're wait, you're staying on tier one. Oh, you're doing that strat. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I hate fighting that strat because it's really good at winning the early game, and yet what the hell's going on here? How are you staying on level one getting these golds? And losing? I guess you're just not getting lucky. It's a strat to stay on level one so you like you gold your your tier one cards better. But I know I just know I'm not playing a deck that's going to need that. Unfortunately, like if you got some hits, we do just lose now. You have 24 cultivation? You have 24 cultivation? Yeah, like they got some hits. <laughs> Oh, you know what they probably did? Did they trade HP for... I don't know what they did. Alright, wishful thinking. I'm going to take this to... Um, eventually play... <laughs> eventually play... Some kind of... Uh, good deck that's reliant on those. So we're in the blue tier... Every five injured. We don't have this active. I mean, we could. We could go... Boom. Boom. Boom, boom. How the hell do I have the chi for this? What would we trash? We would trash Wood Spirit Bud? I don't know. Cool. I'll keep that for later. <laughs> Uh, I guess I could do this. Gives us a little bit of cultivation. Oh my god, this deck is so gross, but will eventually become really bad. I think. Well, this this deck innately, like, because of this, cannot have scaling. Otherwise, it won't work. Basically, tiny hits heal this person. He got a lucky uh, talisman find. Okay, well, it looks like you may be pivoted. No? Pretty slow setup there, but guess what? He is going to do a frankly stupid amount of healing. And you know what is true about this deck? It is kind of unstoppable right now, but it's not going to be unstoppable for long. It's it's going to quite literally it's going to fall off, but not yet. It's going to be a very, very slow, but very, very real win. Because it's just... 
You can't compete with that amount of early game healing. It's just like, it's just too much for this early. Give me my blue. Ooh, we're getting somewhere. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay, we got some awkward stuff going here. It's falling apart a little bit. Ooh. Okay. Uh, I think we made our deck worse before we make it better. We need to remove both of those. But if we do that, then we can't run or Spirit Guard, unfortunately. Yeah, no surprises there. This one is running the um, the deck I would consider to be the, the good one. Okay, pretty lucky placement there. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, uh, plus. So, this is active. It's like it's it's legit active active, but we don't don't have the chi for it otherwise. Oh. Eh. Let's uh let's start getting some stuff together. I think we actually just keep that. Okay. We have chi that we don't need. This is fine. It's fine. A lot of messy, uh, messy setup stuff. Just had to brain that. Uh, actually, Metal Ring is better behind waves if I am going to keep it. I mean, the thing is, I'm not going to keep it, but... Zoop. Zoop. Do it again. Alright, get a little bit of piercing defense is something. Yeah, Force of Waves, or Force of Water last is odd. I think we do win this. Uh, eh, eh. Oh, you do. Okay. Odd. Very odd. Okay. Uh, I do love a double trash on this. I'm, I'm not going to keep it. Because double trash gives me the extra HP and then we move here. Uh, cultivation minus nine, draw eight cards. Actually, yes. Because we can just trash the cards if they're not good. Because we need help. Badly. Okay. Uh, we could run this. Gives us less defense. We can actually just run chase. Hold on. We gotta move quickly here. Let's trash a bunch. Uh, mostly gonna trash ones that... Okay, definitely keeping that. That's really good. Hold on. Getting somewhere. Just gonna trash ones that I know I'm not gonna use for a fact. I don't know for a fact I'm not gonna use that. I actually am probably not gonna use this. Sure. Come on. Uh, lots of brainy roll down here. 
Um, I should swap those. Whatever. Okay. We got a board. Build a board workshop. And since we activated Metal Ring, this is... It's just Chase. Like, there's nothing fancy about it. It's just Chase. Okay, hit me. What a surprise. You won't. Whoop. Oh, this gives me armor based off of how much uh, the difference between our max health is. Guess what? It's going to be a lot. Pretty soon. Currently, it's 12, so it's 12 twice, though. So that's pretty exciting. It's pretty exciting that we have a, a little bit of a counter for... I can't believe they're running this build. What a surprise. Wow. Tan is running the stall build? Wow. I don't really want a different side job card. Okay. Definitely a place for this if we want it. It won't matter. You're getting too much extra chi. Thank you. Finally! Okay. I don't know if I... Do I just combine? Do I want... Do I want just another chase? How much is our HP difference? It's actually pretty high. I think I'm done with this. Cool. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. It's fine. That's why I don't do right-click trash. That's why I don't do right-click trash. I always make the mistakes. I would, I, it would have been just as effective to combine it technically more so. Because we're missing out on what? Uh, we're missing out on four damage. It might matter. Whoop. Ooh, we actually blocked it clean. Okay. Uh, the question is, do we block? We do full block once here. Oh my God. And we said we lined it up on accident to, uh, to full counter. Holy crap. Uh, it's good, but I'm not running it. This is the part about uh, Metal Ring that is good here. Is we can run Metal Spirit Shuttle without really changing our deck too much. We can just kind of streamline it a little bit more. The truth is, I don't know. I don't know. If the tier 5 payoff card is any good with this deck, I actually don't know at all. I'm trying to picture it. it. So it removes our defense and does damage accordingly. It cuts our defense in half and does three times that amount of damage. So basically, 1.5 times your armor as damage, right? Wait. No, 1.25? Like, roughly 1.25. So it's kind of... It's a payoff card that's like that... The Cloud Sect card. That is a blue, mind you. And we don't have to... But we don't have to... Uh, you don't have to remove your defense with that card. A very important factor. That defense stays. Okay. 
armor piercing is all. You just, you just got like a very reliable deck, eh? Is that what's going on? Just a. How do you have? How do you have 80 health? It's just. You just have a deck that has really not had to face any true struggle, huh? Because yeah, we obviously win that. It's, there's nothing wrong with the deck. It's just like it's a totally, totally fine deck. Um, kind of looking for more. There's a world where we keep this. Not really. It would only be worth it if we were running an Earth card or a fire card. I can't run a fire card. I can... Sorry, if I'm running an earth card. Of course I'm running an earth card. If I'm running a metal card that I really want played. And the truth is I don't think that there's a metal card that I really want played twice. Whoop, 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 whoop. Whoop, 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 whoop. Whoop, 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 whoop. Hmm. How to streamline this more? Like, I guess we swap out Earth Spirit... Do we swap out Earth Spirit Dust? It depends who we're fighting. I think we keep this on the sideboard for when we fight this... Satanic piece of trash. Oh, no, and they're running the internal injury version. They actually have a good... They're running a normal? Oh, what? This is such a good tier five. Uh, they only they only find greens are better. It's such a tier five and like such a good tier five in that deck. Like there's no surprise why it's the scummy deck that you know everyone just wants to go in and and do. It, it's it's a really good way to guarantee second or guarantee top four almost. If you get even remotely decent hits, you're pretty much a shoe in for top four. Which is a great way to reliably reliably climb if that is all you're looking for. Alright. Boink. Okay, if I make it to second loop, I win. And then this guy's out of the lobby. Which would be great, because this guy hard counters me if he uh if he hit the tier five um whatchamacallit? Oh my god, thank god. That guy was so close to staying in the lobby. If he hit the... Oh, no! Another quicksand is good. Hi. Oh, I forgot about that. It's a little awkward. Kind of chase. We can't really do too much more chase. I, I think I have to keep this. Who am I fighting? You. We don't have that much difference in max HP. Yeah, they're running the they're running the better deck. Let's see. I, I, the good news is this deck does have a slight counter to that deck, ever so slightly. Uh, so yeah, this is gonna be defense plus six after playing the next card chase. So we'll do this, and then immediately landslide, which is great into quicksand, which does gain benefit off of. Uh, bigger, bigger bursts. They're probably going to end up going first unless I wanted to trash all these cards, which I just don't. I just don't want to do that. Uh, I think... Okay, depending... If, if we can win this, which there is a chance... No, they have ignore defense. It's looking a little... Wait. Wait, what? Wait, 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 why? Oh, they're actually running it wrong. They probably f they probably found that out. They're they're running it wrong. But I I would imagine they figured that out after that last round. Cuz their payoff move doesn't have penetrate, which is kind of like the whole point. Okay, so that's like our burst for now. Which is not that great, but 
Okay, so they ended up getting... They do... They fixed it. They fixed it. They learned. Or no, they didn't fix it. The only reason it worked is because I defended all of their stuff. All right. Bonk. It's so funny. Okay, that's weird. I don't know how to factor that in. Uh, I think we just run one, don't we? Or... Or do we run it back here? Like, do we trash this and run it back there? What the hell, my brain. That may definitely, may be better. It does, it's more, it's basically the same amount of chase. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Okay, in this situation, it would actually be better to be running two cliffs. Oh, you have ignore defense. Oh boy. Well, we're going to have really good defense up for Dharma. I still don't have combined world. Do we go first? There's no world where we go first. There's no, re no reason to trash cards then. Um... I could I could put this here instead, I guess. And then we'd be running boom 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 chase chase boom chase well that no that doesn't work. Oy, oy, oy. We'd have to get rid of Earth Spirit Cliff. I mean we could, I guess. They are going to hurt. Like, I, there's no two buts about it. This is going to be painful. Oh, they have two stacks of guard up. Okay, but it's the consume one. It's the consume one. So this sucks for round one, but they won't know what hits them. Hit them round two if we make it there. And I actually do have a better... I have a better loop than they do. That's good. They probably were mad about that, but you know what's true? The truth is, um, I was, uh, because I had quicksand right after it, I had an equally as nasty loop right after it, man. Okay, so we, uh, we would prefer, oh no, oh no, oh no. One, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six. Who's going first? They will. One, two, three, Four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. This gets skipped. I'm done with that. I like this. I like this. This is this is a good enough showing of this. I'm happy. I I think this is about the best we can do, right? But you're not running max HP anymore, so I guess I was literally keeping this card for you. But you're not... Now you're not playing it. Reverse card... Continuous... All cards with post action makes me... Wait, what? You're doing that just so you can skip another turn. Which may or may not matter. This is awkward as hell, man. Sitting with a couple of cards waiting in the wing for upgrades. There's no way in hell I'm going first regardless. Ay, ay, ay. The annoying thing is these decks have a lot of room for upgrades. I've not played the defensive person. The person who basically gets to do what I do, but they don't have to reduce their defense. Why? Why is it my payoff card, man? I am, uh, I don't make it through another loop. Also, where is my, um... Oh, maybe? 
Oh, thank God. Please kill. Please kill. Please kill. No. All right. Maybe somebody else will kill, though. Okay, so now I'm playing the defensive person. You have one stack of guard. You're going to be going first, which means that you'll block this, which is I don't care. Uh, Narrow Spirit is not bad. I'm just not going to run it. All right. So you're going first for sure. One, two, three. Is that what? Two stacks of guard up? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That actually sucks. Okay, so with that in mind, I need to I need to change things. I actually need I need more attacks in my deck. I could combine. Cause yeah, you get two freaking guard up every single time through. And you have so yeah, two guard up. Jesus, this is so dumb. Look at this. It's going on the second loop. It's going to be two guard up, chase, 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 two guard up, chase. So literally, uh, they are protected. They have a full protected hit two out of every three turns. I, I have to run this. They're blocking this card. Which almost makes me want to run this instead for this fight. It's more defensive. We scale better. We scale better. I I don't know. This is it's just so awkward because they basically they get to defend almost twenty four seven. So I'm gonna do the same thing, but with scaling. I don't think that they have anything going on that has innate damage scaling. They are just... Oh, but they do have... Of course they have armor piercing, though. Ave Maria! Okay. They have three stacks of guard up right now it's just what a what a fundamentally stupid deck this is right here and guess what they full block it even if I hit them anyways this is just fundamentally stupid there's no way I can beat that all right so how do I beat you by getting lots of defense before this happens and hell, maybe even just turning it right around. Where is world spirit? Spirit formation, whatever the hell. Okay, so one, who goes first? It's you, of course. One, two, three. Ignore defense. One, two, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. This is the best I can do. And yeah, this is so annoying that landslide actually isn't good enough here. I Do they have scaling? They don't have scaling. They have chi exhaust. So if I beat them here then I'm good. So I actually don't really want to reduce anything. Uh god. All right. This banks on them not moving their cards. This is going to be a really fun second if I win. And a second. I did say what I wanted to get was a a top 3 which I think considering this deck and its shortcomings, again, the fact that the payoff card is situational is, I think, a problem. Please don't do your payoff card. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, I did it back. Wait! 
that's, you know. They ignore defense. So. They ignore defense, so. I can't do anything about it. This is, it's a guaranteed, guaranteed hundred something damage. I mean, if I hit him with the weaken, that's a thing. Like, I can't win this. I can't win it anymore, except for the fact that they're not going to build according to me. They're not building according to me. They're building according to the other person. That's the only thing I have actually going for me right now. They're going to theoretically change their deck to fight this person because I'm fighting their ghost. So I actually think the best play is to keep it the same because you have to put you have to put chase in there to block their literally like infinite amount of guard up attacks right you have to so I unfortunately I, I still can't play this and I don't think I want to go first if I go first I mess up my order uh, I'm just I'm at the whims of the world like these decks are busted like I can't uh, and Landslide is not even in my deck because, truthfully, it doesn't need to be. It can't be. It it won't work. I won't have enough defense. So, literally, my hope is they change their deck uh, according to the other person. And they did it to, like, get rid of the defense. That's literally the best case scenario for me. Uh, I don't think they did, though. Okay. Cool. Yeah, fair amount of damage. Whatever, whatever. Let's just do damage in the hundreds. Whatever, whatever, whatever. Uh, <laughs> we're, we're doing it. Uh, we'll just infinite, infinite guard up and turn four unblockable 110 damage. Sure. Sure. I'll take a 21-21 rating, and I'll take a top third with this. And honestly, I'm probably never playing this character in this way again unless it gets some kind of a buff to the Tier 5 card. It's just... I don't even think it needs a lot. I think the card itself needs to have some defense on it. Like, bare minimum, right? It's too easy to shut down. And if you're building it optimally, you're playing something that is very hard countered by guard up, which most factions have a way to get some of. And that's not even considering the fact that I was running it with the Painter Chase card, which was the only thing that was activating it in the first place. Because you have to keep in mind, if you play that card normally, you don't get... To, you, you have the damage fall off of defense before your turn. Um, however, 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 also important to note that... Uh, we never found Earth Spirit Combined World, which is the card that makes... Like, never. That was a long game. We never found it once. Uh, the card that makes it so when your defense goes down, it doesn't. That being said, the uh, the final character com that killed us completely ignored defense, which is basically like... Kind of shows the, the flaw of this build, right? It's not hard to ignore defense, and it's not hard to kill somebody with by ignoring defense. Uh, fire spirit builds just kill you by reducing your HP. Uh, internal injury goes through your defense. Guard up completely stops this whole build. Uh, and any build that does a reliably low amount of damage consistently completely counters it as well in any world where you're not running painter. So it's kind of just, it's too niche, it's too situational. If you're playing this character, just and you just want to win, play the Metal Spirit deck. If you want to play this character, you want to have fun, I would say bust this build out in a lobby where people don't know what they're doing is a good step. Step one, this deck is... I bet you this deck is goaded against new players. This deck is probably fundamentally broken against new players. Uh, or pivot into this late game 
in a lobby where none of the counters are there. Unfortunately, there's a lot of counters. But, like, in a lobby where none of the counters are there, I'm talking, yeah, no, uh, no poison, no guard up, no fire, and, yeah, I mean, no unrestrained sword. So, no any of those, because those all counter this. You can't play this late. You can't play this late game against those things. But, hey, it was a fun, it was a fun showing. It was a cool, cool deck that isn't very r consistent. But, alas, alas. That's that. That's going to do it here for today. Thank you for watching. Check out the channel for roguelikes more every single day. Indies and more. Roguelikes, deck builders, auto battlers, auto battling deck builders, deck building auto battlers. Thank you, thank you, and I'll see you next time. Bye!